From afar, one would think there is a funeral, but that is not the case. Villagers in Zambezi district woke up to a rude shock where structures were destroyed and some people injured. According to first-hand information on the ground, some Luvala-speaking people do not want to be rude by Chief Ndungu, prompting them to connive with the Lunda-speaking people, thereby sparking violence and destroying properties and houses. It has also been alleged that some government officials have been masterminding the chaos as they allegedly paid some unscrupulous individuals to engage in the crime. Further reports indicate that some Luvala-speaking people while working with the Lunda-speaking people were pretending to be Lundas to spark chaos. But the Zambia police who sent the team on the ground have given out a different face of the findings contrary to earlier reports. According to Deputy Police Spokesperson Danny Mwale, the fracas was as a result of the conflict between the Lunda-speaking people and the Luvala-speaking people. Mr. Mwale revealed that police in the area have recorded 25 different cases ranging from assault, malicious damage to property, arson, and unlawful wounding. Two of the injured victims are admitted to Zambezi District Hospital, where they are receiving treatment. So far, no arrest has been made as investigations have been instituted, and the Inspector General of Police has dispatched his team of officers to maintain law and order. However, this dispute between the two groups of people may be shocking because no matter the circumstances, the country continues to uphold the one Zambia, one nation legacy. Namwinga Mwinga, for Movie TV News in Lusaka.